Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today. So I'm really, really excited. Um, I think this video is going to be a short but sweet one. Um, for those who follow me over on Instagram, you may already know that I am now a Glossy Box Ambassador, which is so cool and I'm so, so grateful to be working with a really cool brand. Um, I've purchased from Glossy Box myself a couple of times in the past and I think that it's just a really, really cool idea. Before we jump into this video though and I tell you more about me being an ambassador and showing you what is inside September 2020's Glossy Box, please make sure you are subscribed to my channel before we jump in and give this video a like if you do enjoy and you want me to do monthly unboxings on my YouTube as well as over on my Instagram. So yeah, like I was saying, I am now a Glossy Box ambassador, so that means that if you follow me on my social media, I'm most active over on Instagram, but I will try and do some monthly unboxings on my YouTube channel just to show you guys what um, is in the new boxes, if there's any updates, like what's coming, things like that. And I also have a discount code, so I will mention that in a little bit. What I'm gonna do is go through September's glossy box with you. Obviously this is kind of a spoiler or you, you do kind of see bits and bobs that are in the box on the website anyway. Um, but I'm gonna go through the products that are in the September box. And this was last month's box that I didn't do an unboxing for, but you would have seen it over on my Instagram. So at the end, I'll just run through what I did get in here and what I've thought of the products. I've only used a couple of them and I've kind of put them back in here all nice to show you guys. Before we actually get into the box thing, if you don't know what Glossy Box is, it is a beauty box subscription service. So you basically get these boxes sent to you every month. You can sign up for just a one month roll in, cancel whenever. I think there's like a three month, six month, a 12 month subscription. Um, and the box is always worth over 50 pounds. This month's box I think is actually worth over 115. So some of them are like a lot more than others, but it's always way more than what you pay for them, which I think is amazing. And it's such a good way of trying out different products or brands that maybe you haven't heard of or you would never think to buy yourself. I'm super excited for this month's box because it's a spa edition. So it's all about like self care, spa, like moisturizers, just a nice pamper box, you know? So first up is this Wishful Yo Glow Enzyme Scrub. This is what it looks like. Really, really cute little yellow packaging. And I'm pretty sure from what I've seen, Wishful is Huda Catan's brand. If you know Huda Beauty, the makeup brand, Huda, who obviously is behind that. I'm pretty sure this is her skincare brand. Um, and I love a good scrub. So it's like a really gentle kind of exfoliant scrub for your face. Obviously then you just rinse with water. It smells really nice and fresh as well. So I'm excited to give that a go. I cannot get enough of scrubs, exfoliants, face washes. Throw it my way. Then we have, I'm not actually sure how to say this brand. I think it's Ameliorate. <laughs> Intensive skin therapy. Pretty sure this is a moisturizer. This is what it looks like. Again, really like the packaging of this. So it says this is suitable for all skin types. Um, Non-greasy, multi-purpose balm for any troublesome areas. Gently massage until the balm is completely absorbed. It just sounds like a really good intensive moisturiser, which I don't have dry skin. Um, but sometimes I get like small dry patches or if my skin just is not happy which I'm sure we all get. I do love a nice rich moisturiser and like just let that sink in in the evening. I feel like I might have to give all of this a go this evening because I'm gonna run myself a bath. I'm gonna take all this makeup off. I'm gonna wash my hair. Um, so already we've got two products that I am dying to use. We've got the Imperial Leather Foam Burst. I'm pretty sure I've had one of these in a glossy box before and they are just a classic. I absolutely love these. I remember there being something similar, I don't think it was quite these ones when I was younger, that was just gel and it just turned to foam, and I thought it was the best thing ever, but I think it was like a kid's brand. I, I remember the packaging being like some sort of cartoon. Whether I'm making things up, I don't know, but I have had these in the past and I think they're fab. They smell incredible, and I find that they're really, really good for shaving your legs as well, so that's also another thing that I'm gonna do. This is, what scent is this? Lychee and Lotus Flower. And I always find that these just leave your skin feeling really, really nourished as well. It's like quite hydrating at the same time. So yeah, cannot wait to use this. We then have a product that I've never actually used anything like this before, which is a coffee scrub from Mind Tan. Um, I've not heard of this brand, so I'm definitely gonna have a little look into their 
skincare if I like this, but this is an exfoliating scrub for buttery smooth soft skin. So this is what it looks like. I've never used a coffee scrub before and I know a lot of people do, especially to get a fake tan off. So my tan is kind of like starting to come off now. Um, and I do use like self tan erasers and stuff, but a nice scrub to just get any dead skin off um, and leave your body feeling really, really smooth. I mean, it says buttery smooth soft skin. Who doesn't want buttery smooth soft skin? I know I do. Then the last product before our little treat is actually, I think, one of the more expensive products that makes up a lot of the worth in this box. Um, this is a product from Avant, and I'm pretty sure they've put some Avant skincare in the glossy boxes previously. But this is the Hyaluronic Vitamin C um, Moisturiser? This says Supreme Hyaluronic Acid Antioxidizing Duo Moisturiser. That is a mouthful. This is what it looks like. I love this packaging. It's so like minimal and sleek and even though it's not like the bougiest, I feel like I can just tell that this brand is quite expensive. It says you can apply this in the morning or the evening, it's just a moisturiser, um, but hyaluronic acid and vitamin C are perfect in your skincare. So now I'm torn between which one of these I'm going to use later. Maybe I'll use a little bit of both. Um, one side versus the other, who knows, but two good moisturisers. You cannot complain. And then the extra little treat, which I thought was super cute in this month's glossy box that I am definitely going to be devouring after this, is a little Lint Lindor chocolate bar. Oh my god. I'm not a massive fan of eating too many of these. I'm pretty sure they're the ones that you get in the balls and they're very like Christmassy. I do find they're quite rich. Um, but yeah, this was like just a little extra treat that you get in your box this month. If you guys have already ordered the box, or you're thinking about ordering the box, I definitely recommend it. If you are just feeling a little bit meh, need a bit of a pick-me-up. I mean, these boxes are great anyway because it's like a little surprise on your doorstep every month because you forget that you've got a subscription. Um, that's how I feel anyway. But yeah, if you need a little bit of a pick-me-up, you fancy a pamper evening, you want to try some new products, this month's box is absolutely perfect for that. Like I said earlier, I do have a discount code, which will be in the description as well. But if you use the code FERN, you can get your first box for £11.50, including your delivery. So I think that's 15-20% to off. And before I do also show you what last month's box had in it briefly, I know you can't get it now, but just if you were curious or I've used a couple of things in this box anyway so I can tell you like how I got on with it um but they do have and I will give you a little sneak peek they do have a glossy box skincare range coming out so they've actually brought their own skincare range out and they've got a ton of different products that I'm super excited to get my hands on some more of and another super exciting but also quite scary thing is the glossy box advent calendar should now be available to pre-order if you are already a subscriber you get it for 80 pounds on the pre-order but if you aren't subscribed then you will get it for 99 pounds and i think that comes out then towards the end of the month where anyone can just purchase it but it's worth over 390 pounds in the advent calendar and i'm so excited to receive it i'm so excited for the video where i show you guys what is in it obviously it will be a spoiler if you want to use it as an advent calendar but I can't help myself. So I'm sorry for my rambling, but I'm just gonna move on to last month's box quickly and show you what was in it. And just like a variety of things that you do get in glossy boxes every month, if you haven't had one before or you've never really heard about it. Have already used this, put it back in the box. I don't know why. But last month's box had a Brushworks Wonder Complexion Sponge. I love using a sponge for my foundation. I think it, they're just brilliant. And this one is really, really soft and squishy as well. They also had a Steve Laurent Lip Liner, which is really, really creamy, but it's like a darker pinky purple color, which is really pretty. Sticking on the theme of lips, I've had one of these in a box before and I just think such good value for money. But they had a Huda Beauty Demi Matte Lipstick. This one is in the shade Chica. I think that's how you say it. And I'm not being funny, but if you're paying £11.50, obviously with my code for your first box, imagine getting one of these in there which are worth £18 on their own. You just, it's just great. Don't need to say anymore. Another super exciting thing that they've had in other glossy boxes as well before is Molten Brown Stuff. This is a Rhubarb and Rose Bath and Shower Gel. Molten Brown Bath and Shower Gels just smell absolutely incredible and they leave your skin feeling just so clean, 
and they smell great. And then I think it was the first box to receive part of the Glossy Box skincare range. So this is the Eye Boost Cream. I've used this twice, again, popped it back in the box. I don't know why, I could have just showed you the box of the product, but I thought I'd pack it all back away quite neatly. Um, but this is really, really lovely, really hydrating. It is supposed to reduce the appearance of dark circles and puffiness. It does feel really, really fresh under the eyes, so I can't wait to get my hands on more of the skincare if it's anything like this eye cream. That is everything that I have to show you. This month's September box doesn't seem to have sold out just yet, so I'll get this up as soon as I can. The link is in the description to go and purchase. Remember to use the code FERN to get your first box for £11.50, including your delivery. And let me know what you guys think of Glossy Box. If you've had a box from there before, if you're going to order September's, what you think of the advent calendar that's coming out. I'm just super excited. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments below whether you want me to do one of these every month. It's just like a bonus video. It doesn't have to be too long. I can literally just run through it. If you guys want to see my thoughts on the box or just want to see a bit more of an in-depth video on what, what you're getting before you subscribe. Talking about subscribing, please make sure you are subscribed to my channel before you leave. It would mean the absolute world to me. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.